Hello everybody and welcome to Dunrobin Castle in Sutherland which has its own railway station. This rather elegant station on the line from Inverness to Wick and Thurso built at the request of the Duke of Sutherland who was quite keen to have a railway. In fact he was so keen that he built the stretch track between here and Helmsdale before it was connected to the rest of the line at Goldsby. And there is of course a Gallic version of the name of the station. It is a request stop. Being a request stop you have to press the plunger which is here to get the driver to stop. But I'm not going to press the button to request it because I don't intend to use it. To get from the station to the castle you have to cross the A9 which is very busy and very noisy being part of the NC500 route. It's also not a bad station to alight to go for a walk. There's a hill in the background Oh my god! And there's a camera checking for improper use of the level crossing. And there's the level crossing with the Duke of Sutherland looking fondly down on the station. He was quite a railway enthusiast and sometimes he would invite railway officials to the castle for tea for a chat about locomotive performance and things like that. The station was opened in 1870 and officially closed in 1965 although for much of its life it was officially a private station and it reopened to the public in 1985 and is still open to the public. And I suspect this is where the Duke of Sutherland's private locomotive and carriage were kept. He did on one occasion manage to drive his private locomotive and carriage all the way to Inverness, much to the surprise of railway staff at Inverness. And there's a train due in an hour, so let's go and have a look at the castle first, yeah? The castle looks a bit spooky with the sun behind it. And looking up the drive, the station is at the top there. You can walk down to the beach, taking the track to the right-hand side of the castle, and you can see the history of the castle on Wikipedia or their own website. And here comes the train to Wick. This is Goldsby Station which was the first terminus of the line in 1870 until the Duke of Sutherland assisted in the construction further north. Oh. Train for Inverness. And just a little reminder, if you've enjoyed watching my film, you can look at my link here to Kofi to sponsor me with a coffee.